France's President Emmanuel Macron will host NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg here in Paris this Wednesday, a meeting that, according to the Elysee Palace, had been set up prior to the dramatic events we saw unfold in Russia over the weekend, a meeting that was originally designed to prepare for the NATO summit in Vilnius in July, but of course a meeting that will be dominated by that failed Wagner rebellion in Russia and what that means for the war in Ukraine. Emmanuel Macron, who has reportedly followed the developments in Russia hour by hour throughout the weekend, he was in constant communication with his American, German and British counterparts and has come forward to say that what happened in Russia unveils the cracks, the divisions within Russia's camp, as well as the fragility of Vladimir Putin's army, as well as those auxiliary forces such as the Wagner Group. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see just what comes out of that meeting concretely. Both men agree on the necessity to continue to support Ukraine in its counter-offensive and will uh, most likely uh, develop new ways for that partnership to continue to be strong and unanimous across the alliance. Emmanuel Macron uh, is also uh, reportedly going to push for the ratification, the rapid ratification of Sweden's membership following that of Finland's. Annelise Borges in Paris for Euronews.